As he grew up during World War II, Terry Nation had vivid memories of the war and, in particular, the Nazis. The Daleks share many characteristics with the Nazi party deliberately. They both believe in the superiority of their race, whether it means the entire species, like the Daleks, or their ethnicity, like the German Nazis. Genesis of the Daleks is the most clear depiction of this parallel, with the Khaleds showing dedication to their cause and near-complete conformity. It also showed the killing of any opposed to their ideology, in this case, the cowled scientists. Their shrieking voices were designed to parody the loud repetitive chanting and rants associated with Nazi rallies. The casting out or forced labor of the Mutos is comparable to the Holocaust, as is the cowled consensus of them as lesser beings. Another comparison to the Holocaust appears in the Dalek invasion of Earth, in which Daleks refer to the destruction of Earth as, the final solution, a phrase associated with Nazism. They even greet each other by raising their plunges vertically in a way reminiscent of the Nazi salute. Another blatant reference appears in Journey's End with Daleks chanting, Exterminieren, as they invade Germany. Just War and Daleks Among Us more explicitly highlight the parallels and similarities between the Nazis and the Daleks. Contrarywise, other writers have pointed out the flaws in comparing the Daleks to the Nazis. John Peel noted in the introduction to the official Doctor Who and the Daleks book, they have been compared over the years with Nazis, but this is a tenuous connection at best. Certainly there is a lack of individuality, an unquestioning obedience of orders and a willingness to die for the race. All of this epitomized the Nazi stormtrooper ideal. It isn't hard to see, though, even in the most evil member of the Nazi hierarchy, some spark of buried humanity. Even the elite had their fears and superstitions. The Daleks had none of these. John Peel in A History, Lance Parkin expands on this idea. Real-life analogies quickly fail when applied to the Daleks. At times they're compared to the likes of Nazis, but in truth they're literally lacking in humanity. Even, conquest, as we generally understand the term doesn't really interest them. Sometimes they put foes to work as slaves, as in death to the Daleks, but this is almost inevitably in the interest of facilitating new atrocities and exterminations. The point is that one can, and should, hope to use reason against real-world governments, but there is virtually no chance of diplomacy succeeding against the Daleks. Basically, the Daleks collectively remain united behind one goal. Kill everything that isn't a Dalek. Lance Parkin